Alright, and welcome back. In our last episode, we won a couple of major victories with Marcus Julius on this bridge here. And we also took the city of Palma. So, uh, in this one, we're, we're going to try to strike back against the Gauls. They got a pretty large garrison in uh, Narbo Martius, but uh, we'll see what we can do. I think um, I don't need such a big army to protect this bridge. I can protect this bridge with a much smaller force. So that's what I'm going to try to do. But I do want to send some reinforcements down. What is the Scipio, Scipii doing here in our lands? I'm not quite sure. Uh, Pathium over here is having a little bit of uh, public order problems. We've got a little bit of... We still have this uh, shrine to Abnoba. Uh, I may try to get rid of this soon. We gives us the upgrade to the missiles. However, um, if you look at our um, current armor, also upgrades the light missiles or the missile weapons. So. I think um, we we could train uh, we could send our archers over to our capital to be retrained. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and intern and see what happens. All right, it looks like Gaul is amassing more forces. They haven't uh, had the Kurds attack me on the bridge again. That's kind of understandable. So I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade. Um, Patvium. I'm going to build an armorer here and we'll see if it gives us a plus two to missile weapons. If so, we'll keep the shrine. Otherwise, we'll dismantle it and build a new, build a shrine to Jupiter or something like that. Still don't know what the Scipii is doing in our territories here. They have a really large army. I do want to get more uh, principes, so let's do that. All right, so we've got a couple of good units here. We'll get them going. And we'll get another one of these guys. Send them on the road too. A couple of uh, Astati. Let's get a Velites too. And I definitely want to get more archers. And we'll send this archer down to a retain to be retrained. Alright, we can finally get the governor's palace in Mediolananum. So we'll do that. We got a Spanish army over here in Palma. That's definitely concerning. Uh, let's get a Hastati. Uh, but I don't think they can take us. They don't look strong enough. Let's go back over here. And over in Masilla, we'll we'll go ahead and get walls here. Alright, let's end turn and we'll keep an eye on the Spanish here. Okay, we got a general who, uh, he's 30 years old, a little bit old. He's got some influence and he's got extra hit points. So we'll go ahead and accept him. We'll take a look at where he is. He's over in our capital. Uh, he's going to need to be retrained. We'll get another Hastani. So we're going to train up more guys here, get the best archers that we can, get some more principes. I'm going to go ahead and build highways over here to get the additional income. Let's go ahead and end our turn. All right, uh, they're attacking us on the bridge again. So Marcus Julius is a, turning out to be a really excellent commander, but he's not very loyal. 
All right, let's go ahead and fight this battle. This will be another massive victory for us, I'm sure. Here comes their general. Okay, I forgot about the um, stupidity of the war bands. Let's get out of there. Come on, run. Get out of there. Alright, let's get all these guys in on the action. My mercenaries are about to get overrun. The enemy general is running away. This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it's beyond belief. Alright, they're routed. Let's get them. All right, not too bad. We killed 839, and we only lost 28 guys. So another huge victory for Marcus Julius. Oh, here comes Spain. I'm ready to sail. Set sail, General. Attack! We've got 9 to 4 strength. They do have a lot of warhounds. I'm a little bit worried about the Warhounds getting at our Velites or something like that. They can do a lot of damage. We've got 11 attack. These dogs are tough, so... Um, in mass, they can do some definite, definitely do some damage. Especially if they get uh, into my Velites or something like that. Let's try to get their... I'm going to try to lure their war dogs to chase my cavalry, so let's, let's see if that'll work. want to make sure we close the gates okay let's see if I can sacrifice my barbarian cavalry those dogs are so vicious Uh, don't open the gates. Uh, I think this strategy in is going to be a disaster. Not a smart tactic. Just look at these vicious dogs. I didn't want to open the gates. These dogs are just wrecking havoc. Yikes. Disaster. It's a disaster. Oh my goodness. <laughs> They're going after these guys. Dogs are nasty. Okay, let's get out of the city. Let's just get everyone out. Double time. Okay, we're gonna. These guys are gonna have to defend against these dogs. 
run. Alright, let's bring out the bring the fight. We don't really have much cavalry left. This battle's a lot tougher than I thought. It's really... I made a huge mistake sending my guys after their... Sending that one cavalry after their warhounds. Mainly because I didn't expect them to open the gates for those guys. I was hoping that we would just let them get killed by the war warhounds. But, uh, yeah, that was not a good idea. Um... I should have. I thought maybe like we could hit him with our missiles or something. I don't know. It just wasn't a smart move. Big mistake. And now it's really costing us. All right, what are they doing? They're charging. Let's get our missiles to come up here. Run. Looks like they got mostly skirmishers themselves. Um, let's just advance. Unit, Infantry! Unit, 
Let's try to take out their last uh, infantry. Get them to route. Actually, you know what? Maybe we can hit their their general with the uh, javelin. And we'll flank them. Still got a lot of warhounds left. Those are really powerful units. I probably sh should uh, recruit those myself. Where's their general? We got him. We got their general. Let's see if we can get them to flee before they release their hounds. Good, they're fleeing. I don't think they'll be able to unleash their warhounds. The enemy are amazed. Well, that was a really costly vis victory. Although we only lost 229 guys, but those warhounds just devastated our guys. Uh, we we did manage to take out more than we lost, and I think we will have wiped out this uh, this army, but this is going to hurt our attempts at a counterattack. Uh, let's go take a look at our armies here. Let's go ahead and merge our guys, and then I uh, am going to retrain a Hastati. I'm going to recruit another Hastati, and then we'll hit this fleet here. And we won. Getting our trade route back. So we were betrayed by Spain again. All right. Uh, they got another big stack. I don't know if they're going to try to hit us again. Let's get another Prince of Base to back them up. And I think instead of going after Gaul, I'm going to send and just leave Marcus Julius here and then send a, an attack force into Spain directly. Let's get him retrained. Get another Principes. Let's get more guys out. I think I do need a few more Equites, so I'll, I'll recruit one. Just continuing to reinforce. Hmm. Don't really want to build any of these here in Segesta. So here we need to train more archers. I think I will get more town watch here, and we'll send them to Pat v Pat of VM so that we can take care of the public order. I am gonna train a Hastati, I mean Equites, and this guy needs to get get on the move. Oh yeah, I'm gonna send my new general out there too. Get these two guys on the move as well. Yeah, I think I am going to destroy this shrine. It's going to hurt our happiness, but I will get a uh, shrine to Jupiter. And that will give us plus 10 happiness. Since we have nothing else to build here, I'm going to go ahead and get a town watch over here in Segesta and send them over here. And then we're send this guy over here, and then I'm gonna get this Principe to march out. There we go. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and end my turn. All right, we can get some trade routes. I will take that, and I want to see if we can trade map information. Nice. They got a very large size, but not a lot of provinces. Okay, Spain wants a ceasefire. You know what? Uh, I'm going to make a counter proposal. I want money. 
I want 2,000 denarii and I want a regular tribute of 500 for 10 turns. If they will accept that we will do and then we'll throw in trade rights and then see if they'll accept that. Okay, nice. We're getting a lot of money as tribute from them. Um, that worked out pretty well. Yeah, again, I'm not going to do this mission. It's just too far away for, from us. We need to focus on Gaul now, I think. Germany is the strongest faction. Wow. Yeah, let's focus on Gaul. Uh, we've got good money now that Spain is um, Ready to sail. is pacified. Set okay, sail. we're going to go ahead and upgrade our temple as well here. Oh, we can upgrade all our boats. You know what? I don't need so many boats. Let's go Ready ahead and to merge sail. these. Ready to sail. And then I will retrain them so they don't have fewer guys to train retrain. Masilla, what do we want to get over here? Actually pretty decent income. Let's get some roads. We're getting a large force over here. What do they got over here? Uh, can I finally move my spy out? I want to yes, hit... Master. On my way. On my way. Moving. Moving. Orders! Move out! So I can still hold this bridge. They may attack me again. Which would be really nice. And one more turn to armor. Then I will get... I will uh, demolish the uh, shrine here. Alright. Over here... We got another little rebellion. We can handle that pretty easily. So let's take out these guys. It should be enough. What do they got? Just peasants, yeah. It's definitely gonna be overkill for this battle. Let's go ahead and fight it. All right, we're up here on top of the hill. Let's get our guys to fire a will. March them down. All right, I'm gonna hit their peasants with my general. Just uh, worry about these guys. He should wipe them out. Get out of there. Turn around, attack. Okay. They're going to be wiped out instantly. I don't want to get thrown at missiles at, so I'm going to go ahead and send these guys to charge. No, we'll wait for our cavalry. No sense getting um, Hestadi's killed if we don't have to. We did lose a general's bodyguard. Let's go ahead and take him out. Charge. Alright, we got 275 kills. We lost one guy. That was a general's bodyguard. I don't, I won't, it's amazing that a peasant was able to kill a general's bodyguard. I'm surprised. Victory! Cool, we got a turncoat slave, so... That worked out in our favor. Get this guy back into the capital. 
He's actually a net negative on our taxes. Yikes. We gotta get this guy out of... He's just a terrible leader. Is it because... Oh, he's got a 5% penalty on all trade income. So let's get him to, to the front. Imperator. This city, I guess, doesn't need a general. Alright, over here we just built the forums. So I think I'm going to go ahead and build highways. That will really help our income. And we'll get more principes. And over here I'm going to get more archers. I'm going to go ahead and build a stone wall in Medio Lenanum. Because it's kind of a border frontier town. Okay, I think I'm going to end turn, and then next turn I will start my campaign against Gaul, try to take over this city, but take it back over. And we'll, of course, keep an eye on Gaul, I mean Spain over here. Let's, let's end turn. Okay, Spain attacked me again. I guess they didn't like paying me money every turn. So back to the original plan. We're gonna hold off the bridge and then get these guys destroyed. Oh, I sunk them. Good. And we'll go over here and uh, blockade them. I'm gonna recruit a ship over here. We'll use this to ferry our troops over. General, we'll wait one more turn. And we'll start the war with Spain. guys not the town watch and hopefully that will take care of the happiness problems oh looks like we do have a another rebellion to put down so we'll go ahead and do that we don't need so many guys we'll just bring this One more hostility. Attack! What do we got here? Naked fanatics. Engage the enemy. You're gonna wait out Over the fog. The All right, slaves. start the battle. We got a massive Great hill. Okay, there they are. Let's get our guys up on top of the hill. Yeah, I'm going to send one unit of archers to start attacking, and if they chase them, then my other archers will hit them. Looks like they're not going to chase us, so let's get our other group of archers to attack too. And they don't have any armor, so they're just we're just going to absolutely destroy them. But I don't want to hit them just yet. Let's um, let's get this second unit first because I think the there are only 12 of them left, and it's harder to hit a smaller group. So we'll hit the uh, 
the other group first. So they only got five guys left, but we'll keep firing at them. Try to get their general. Okay, let's go ahead and hit the uh, peasants. Next. We might be able to wipe out their whole army with just archers, and we were. Alright, that was an easy victory. Just lost one guy. Uh, I'm gonna try to get him back into town. I'm gonna build a watchtower here since I'm here. Get him in. And hopefully this will help the public order. I can't get my full army back in. Unfortunately, I have to lower taxes. Get some more archers. Yeah, I'm gonna have to lower taxes just a little bit. Uh, maybe I can get another equites in here. No. But I think I can get a town watch. Yeah, there we go. We're back up to very high taxes. Gonna keep recruiting principes. I think I'll get another equites too. And get my spy to move out. Next turn. All right, Rome is now the strongest faction. Cool. But we are not the richest faction. That's for sure. All right, we're going to send Imperator. a couple of our generals out on the boats. We'll get an army here. Get some equites. Let's see, what do we got here? We've got really good, strong infantry, a couple of velites. And I get you on the boat, too. Boarding. And do I want to send this guy out as well? Let's just uh, stick with Quintus. Ready to sail. We'll just send one general out now. Maybe send a backup later. And we'll get some more guys in there. For sure. Get some Hastati. Another Velites. There we go. Try to get a full stack. Imperator. I actually don't need so many guys here protecting this bridge. But I think I can send one more Equites. So let's get a Principe and another Equites to get on that boat too. Um, sure, why not? I think we'll be fine. I'm going to send this fleet Ready out. Set sail. Protect him. Set sail. No more moves, sir. General. Move out. I'm going to march General. this uh, archer out towards Fire. the front lines. Get another Principe out towards the front lines. Onward. Out of move, sir. And get Impact my Equites train up here. We'll train another Equites. Let's do a forum. We need the trade. We need the money. Over here, another Principes. We need money. Yikes, we're out of money. I gotta hold off on uh, recruiting new soldiers. No equites. Let's just get these guys retrained. And I'm gonna disband this unit. And I really can't build anything because I don't have enough money. Yeah, we definitely gotta expand into Spain. I think that's our best bet. All right, uh, in turn. Sir, move out. Move 
depleted, sir! Daryl! Mark! Imperator! Daryl! Imperator! Daryl! Sir! Onward! Imperator! Move out! Out of move, sir! Ready to sail! Ready to sail! Yes, Captain! Go ahead and fight these pirates. Even though they have a really good general, they don't really have many ships left, so we'll have to... And then we're going to blockade Spain. And we'll send our guys out. We definitely need to get a better shrine here. I don't want to keep so many troops here. I don't want to recruit anything. No more recruiting. But I can build some stuff. Let's get an academy. Or a large temple of Jupiter. A co arena. Let's get a academy. And we're getting one more turns to highways over here. We're going to get the forum over here. That'll really get us some more money. And Tegesta is just slowly growing. I wonder if I should recruit peasants over here. This city is just growing way too fast. And how about over here? I want to get Segesta to grow a little bit faster. Alright. Any more troops I want to send out to the front lines? Sure. All right, we'll end our turn. Carthage wants a ceasefire. Offer trade rights, and we'll just get a thousand dollars. How about that? Fine. <laughs> we'll just do that. We need the money. All right, we can get our army out. They've got their faction family member over there. Let's go ahead and. Get our army on off the, the boats. We'll attack their navy. For Victory! And we will blockade their port. We'll destroy this guy, Captain... What's his name? Captain Lawn? Engage the enemy! Victory! We'll just park on this bridge and see if they attack me. Alright, over here, I want to get these peasants over. Let's move this guy first. I want to get these peasants disbanded. And same with over here. Send them to Segesta. We'll keep doing that. Reduce the population of these border towns. Increase the population of Segesta. Alright, can we afford to actually build an academy here? Let's do it. And Masilla can get a market. Nice. An agent found in Masilla. Okay, let's just keep an eye on this guy. He's got a lot of troops here just hanging around, but we'll let him hang out there. We're fine. We're really safe sitting on this bridge. See if he wants to attack us. Greece is the strongest faction. Interesting. They don't seem like they have a lot of settlements left. What is the Scipii doing? They got guys over here in Greece, and then they've got guys right in our lands. Like a huge army. Why aren't they fighting Carthage? I guess they are down here. But why do they have such a big army in our lands? I have no idea what they're doing. I'm going to get another spy so we can spy on Spain. Actually yes. send this guy out to Spain. On my way. I'm going to go ahead and intern. Gaul again to attack me on my famous bridge. I have a much smaller army this time, however, uh, I'm pretty confident that I'll win this because there's just this huge choke point here. <laughs> here we go again.
What is going on? What are these people doing? Is that their general? Let's just go. Let's just go get them. Everybody. And we should get, kill their general soon. He's right in the midst of us. He's fleeing. We kill him. Good. And now get my archers to just halt, cease fire. Alright, there we go. The enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee. The god Alright. Took out 1988 guys and only lost 47. Another huge victory on the bridge. Uh no, 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 no. We're not gonna do that. Decline. Okay, they didn't hit us on the bridge. They were smarter than that. So let's see, let's get our spy over here. On my way. Moves depleted, sir. We got rebels over there. Sir. Hmm. Let's go ahead and take this army out. Victory. Attack. Wow, really upgraded uh, missile skirmishers and some Iberian infantry, which are not that strong. Their general is uh, like Cav. So let's go ahead. And this is a um, really strong army here, so we should be able to take care of them pretty good. Alright, we're just going to hit them with a standard Roman formation. Let's go ahead and move out. They've probably got better skirmishers than we have, but our archers actually gonna have longer range. Let's get our archers up front. Let's have our archers hit them on the left flank here, the Siberian infantry. And we'll get our cavalry over here to make them nervous. And this cavalry over here will make him nervous. All right, we're going to start firing. Let's go ahead and switch to the right flank. Okay, they're sending out their guys. They're skirmishers, so let's hit them with our skirmishers. Oh no, that's Iberian infantry. Interesting. They're sending out their infantry. Let's get our cavalry to hustle up and uh, try to envelop their, their infantry over here. We can take out their infantry right away. Uh, looks like they're backing off, which is understandable. Let's just continue our flanking maneuvers. Let's see what this group's doing here. They, they're confident, huh? Well, when they hit our equites, I don't think they'll be so confident anymore. Nope. All right, let's make sure our the bulk of our forces. Let's get our infantry moving forward. I don't think anybody is? Let's, let's hold up on our skirmishers. Let's just get them out here. Yeah, 
Make sure we surround them. Just keep moving. Okay, they're sending their guys out after my cavalry. Let's let them get exhausted and then we'll... Well, actually, we can surround them. And same over here. We need our general to move up. All right, these guys are just light cav. Let's let's just go after their general. Let's see if I can take out their general. All right. Let's go take out this infantry with a with my cavalry. They're surrounded. Got them to run. Oh, and I got I got attacked by this guy by their general in a wedge formation. But there's their general right in the front. Maybe I can take him out. Is that their general? No, it's just a regular guy. General's probably somewhere in the middle. Let's hit these guys. I'm sure they'll route. Hit these guys. Okay, they're routing. Alright, take out these Iberian infantry. The gods have filled the heart of the enemy Alright, their general's dead. And now his men fear us. It is time to press the attack. Not sure if this is a heroic victory, but it's a good one. We only lost 42 guys, pretty good. We it was kind of important for us to have a big victory because I didn't want to weaken this army because they don't have any uh, support coming up. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and park on the bridge and we'll see what he does next turn. Um, we could go and strike this navy, but they could have guys on there. Let's send a couple of boats here. Uh, let's do more than two. Let's do three boats. Take on this guy. Just in case they're trying to do some funny business. And then we'll just park them back in our ports. Let's uh, retrain them. Let's merge them first. No, let's retrain them all. I want to keep them. Even get one more. Keep a good, strong navy. Fight off the pirates. Fight off any kind of anything that the Spain wants to do. That's kind of funny. All right, we're back to being the strongest faction again, but definitely not the richest. Uh, we could get this if we had enough money, but we don't. In fact, we really can't build anything. Uh, we'll wait until we take, uh, just sit here on the bridge <laughs> and on this bridge. Alright, and with that, I think I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in it here. Thanks for watching. Bye.